Hi pals, coming up on this week's episode of Go With The Heat, the team investigates a battle over a frozen reggae popsicle in the episode The Big Thaw. On this week in Vice, we'll be taking a look back when this episode of Miami Vice aired from October 19th to October 25th, 1987, when Miami Vice was king. In news, on October 20th, Major Bruce T. Garden flying a United Air Force A-7D-4-CV Corsair II aircraft was forced to make an emergency landing at Indianapolis International Airport en route to Tinker Air Force Base in Nevada. On approach to the airport to make the emergency landing, T. Garden was forced to eject as the plane was short of the runway. The plane would bounce off a roof and embankment and crash into the lobby of the Ramada Inn. Ten guests in the hotel would die. Nine from the crash and one days later due to significant burns from the fireball that erupted through the hotel. In this week, between Whitesnake and Michael Jackson on the Hot 100 is Lost in Emotion from Lisa Lisa and Cult Jam. This is the second number one for Lisa Lisa and their album Spanish Fly in 1987. The album would go platinum and reach number seven on the Billboard Hot 200. The band would continue their success through the 80s and 90s, but this would be the last time Lisa Lisa and Cult Jam would reach number one on the Hot 100. In movies, Fatal Attraction still has four more weeks at the top of the box office, so we're still going through the archives. On October 23rd, the film Suspect hit screens across the U.S. The film has a deep cast starring Cher, Dennis Quaid, Liam Neeson, and Joe Montana. Written by Eric Roth and directed by Peter Yates, the courtroom mystery film was easily overlooked in the shadow of Fatal Attraction and performed admirably, even if the ending is controversial. And that's everything you need to know that was happening when Miami Vice was king. Be sure to join us on GoWithTheHeat at GoWithTheHeat.com. I'd love to hear from you. Email the show GoWithTheHeat at gmail.com or follow us on Twitter at GoWithTheHeat. That's all for this week. Bye, pals.